Hi, my name is Jimmy Lick. I'm from Drill Riders TV Productions, and today we're going to learn how to put lipstick marks in Photoshop. The first thing that we're going to do is we're going to grab the magic wand tool. Okay. Once you have both images open, we'll go to the lips first. We're going to duplicate the background so that way we can't mess up the original image. We'll go over to the magic wand tool click on magic wand and you want to take your tolerance up to about 20, 21 is fine and click once until everything's highlighted, that's pretty good once you have that selected you want to right click click on select inverse and then I'll select your lips right click again and we'll go to layer via copy now you can see we have our lips without the background. We still have this white on the inside so let's get even deeper in there and select that again with tolerance at 21. We can layer via cut this time. And I'll cut out the white over here and we can just turn that off and now we have pretty good transparent lifts. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take layer 2 I'm going to right click I'm going to go to duplicate, fire, or duplicate layer now we're going to duplicate it onto the other image that we brought in, minus image 0094. So now we'll go over to that image, and you can see that all the lips were duplicated onto this file. What we can do is transpose these lips, or transform. What we can do now is transform these lips. Just by scaling them down. If you hold down shift, it keeps it proportional. The next thing that you would want to do is to kind of go back into transform and actually warp the lips so they fit perfectly on his skin. So we'll go up to edit, down to transform, click on warp. You can kind of just tweak the lips so they bend a little bit. pretty much just about playing with it till you get the right positioning. Once you're done you press enter and that fits the lips a little bit better. You can also lower the opacity so you get some skin tone showing through. That's pretty much it. Once you click file, save as, you can rename your file and you're done. I'm Jimmy Lick from Drill Riders TV Productions and that's how you put lip marks on a person. Thanks for watching.